What's going on guys, Shadowinja here, and yesterday we got some CGI trailers for these new operators. I will admit, it is kind of different than I thought it would be. It's They were messed up into one, and kind of the setting and the mindset that they were going for was a little bit weird. Now, the new defender was just running through walls, so clearly confirmation that he is going to be running through walls. If you guys didn't get that already, he's running through the desert. And the new attacker, she is in space. Now this all seems to be a hologram and you know she's just living out her holograms. She can tell she is very, very good at her, hel her holo uh, holograms, holocron, that's a holocron, that's Star Wars, holograms. But in general, I mean, it's a weird setting. One's in the desert looking at a castle, the other one is a hologram on the moon looking at Earth. It, it was, it was weird. It was weird. But in all, I mean, it looked pretty cool and judging from the fact that the attacker is going to be having an hologram you can control. I am extremely curious on how that's going to work. Like, I'm, I'm trying to figure out, like, what is the purpose it will apply to the team? You get what I'm saying? Like, controlling a hologram, what would that do for the team? I mean, maybe you can get some information, people shooting it by accident. But there has to be a way to balance out the fact that, uh, you know, someone, like, has to be able to tell this like it's it's weird maybe a mute jammer just like slows it down i'm curious how you're gonna count this because it can be either really powerful or really weak anything in the middle i highly doubt ubisoft can do so it makes me looking at that operator very eh but the new defender is in roamer that i think was very much needed in rainbow six siege now how effective he will be when joining the meta for rainbow six siege is definitely up in the air he could be a completely wasteful operator, but he also could be really, really essential to one of those more soft, soft wall maps that has a lot of soft reach. And he can pretty much flip the tide on the attackers when it comes to not only retaking control of objective, but just being a nuisance and quickly traveling around. Man, my phone went off for no reason. So there's a lot of different things that can happen. And the loadout for the defender is currently a MP5 and a spaz. Now, honestly, I don't know if I'll run the MP5 for this guy, depending on the map. I think I'll run the Spaz, judging the fact I can run through walls. Now, again, how are you going to utilize and effectively be Kool-Aid guy? Uh, I don't know. This this trailer didn't really say much. Just kind of confirmed their abilities. Gave some weird settings. Technically, the defender was looking up in the moon. Guessing at the new attacker, and the attacker was looking down to Earth on the control hologram. And she was looking down on Earth. So it's just, uh, I don't know. I don't know. This trailer was cool. It was, you know, w what it was. But does it get me excited for these new operators? I can't say that for sure. But again, a full reel is coming this Saturday, the 15th, or tomorrow. And I'm curious to see what Ubisoft is going to do, what they're going to present. But in all, I mean, it is what it is. I hope that what... Uh, the new defender is looking at is potentially a new map. We're gonna get a desert map. It looks like, it looks like honestly they're looking at fortress. In all uh, essence, like I feel like the guy is looking at fortress, but I can be entirely wrong. I could just be the architecture is maybe very similar. But in general, I hope it's a brand new map that they're showcasing, or maybe even a fortress rework. I might be okay with that. Depends how much of a rework it is. But in, I just hope we get a new map at the end of the day. I really just, that's I think my biggest thing about the season is that I just want a new map. The new operators can kind of care less about. I really just want a new map. And this trailer, hopefully get teases us a new map. But the new attacker and defender, like everybody else, I, I don't really see nothing crazy about them. You know, the attacker has potential, the defender has potential. But will Ubisoft live up to their potential? We got to wait and find out. I'll basically give you the details for us tomorrow when they come out when they get a full reel but that's pretty much all i gotta say on this hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys like this video if you did enjoy subscribe for more rainbow six breakdowns news gameplay videos and discussions at, in, in general but yeah that's all i got to say for this one hope you guys enjoy the video until next time guys hope you guys have a good one shout out to you here and i'm out